welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Jacqueline. This I'm is David. David. Hi. This is not, no, it is my jungle. <laughs> are you all right? <laughs> I've messed this up so many <laughs> times already. It's fine. Okay. Um, I was also just eating my hair. It wouldn't be uh, David and Jack's video if it wasn't a little bit chaotic and silly. Yeah, so for sure. Welcome back. Um, if you're not new here, I appreciate you for coming back. He has <laughs> yeah, I'm a sorry. YouTube channel <laughs> as well. Yes. David Batterina. I'll yeah. leave it linked down below for you. It's literally always linked down below, but I'll pin it to the top of the comment section so that you can go and give him a sub. He is finally uploading new videos. I'm working on it. So go and check them out. Anyway, today we are doing Last time, this is a part two, or like yes. episode two, of a series that we like to do on this channel where I read or he reads out my negative comments oh, yeah. and we react and respond to them. Good stuff. Last time I called it hate comments and you guys were like, they're not really hate comments, they're just kind of negative, so. Some of these are. Hate is more <laughs> of an aggressive word to put in like the thumbnail though, so I'm not gonna lie. That's still the word I'm probably going to use, but these are more just... Unkind. Miserable human beings. Miserable human being comments. <laughs> yes. So, you guys enjoyed it last time, so here we are again. So here's more. <laughs> here's more negativity. It's fun for me. For you. It is good. No, yeah. because you have to be able to laugh at these things. If you yeah. can't laugh at them... Monetize your haters. These idiots have control over your thoughts. No. Right? And you're going to have to start wearing tinfoil. No, I forgot and about most of these. I was going through sending them to you and I was like, oh yeah. You've mentioned a lot of these like to when me. They happen, when they happen. But then yeah, I forget. For sure. so. No. Now we're just going to, it's like a trip down negativity lane. Yes. It's nice. All right. So here we go. First one. Christina Buzzard. putting them on the screen. Buzzard? Too. No. Christina Blizzard. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> public comments. So. Yeah. These are, these are public comments. Your name is not being blurred out. Do you want out. me to read the comment and then you're reaction your response or just like uh, you know I'm just gonna read the comment Christina says it was eight minutes and 22 seconds in before you got to I love it when people do this before you got to the point of the video then as soon as you started to talk about it two ads started please take this as a constructive criticism that is just too long to keep someone dangling wishing you well I'm trying to share important information your reply. Oh, wishing me well in trying to share information. Yes. But I can just shorten the reply for you. You don't have to read it because <laughs> this was a chatty repot video. Like, I'm pretty sure that was the title. Like, I let you guys know when it's a rambly video by putting it in the title using the word chatty, letting you know that I'm going to be talking a lot in this video and it's Chatty. not i don't know why she thought it was meant to be like an informative video it might have been repotting like a specific plant and very casually giving like care tips about that plant as i'm going but i'm also giving like anecdotal stories about my life and like a different plant and like just how my day has been how think, my week um, has been like, i think we should try this when you're sitting across from a friend and having a conversation over coffee just be like it's been seven minutes and 46 seconds for you to get to the point sometimes i feel like that though yeah, yeah. um <laughs> but it is just really rude when it's my video and it's like my channel and you're telling me that i am talking well, this, is what you're saying. this is a plant channel i'm giving you constructive feedback the title of the video is pretty clear this one's my favorite because this one's this one's really good this right? one i didn't get on my channel so you guys know my good friend svetlana over at firefly in the room i was watching an unboxing video of hers like months ago she got like rare plant mail from somebody in another country or something big huge box you guys will remember if you watch her channel big huge box of plants that she got gifted to her and she mentioned to me really quickly in that video something like something she was saying i don't remember it might have been like oh my god so cute or like something she said and she mentioned me she was like my friend she's like i sound like my friend jacqueline over at jacqueline's jungle and then Somebody commented this on her video, not so, even mine. So I just happened to see it. I don't even watch all of her videos. So Ann Driegers yes. decided to comment, OMG, please don't start talking like Jacqueline's Jungle. She spelled your name wrong. I know. Please, I'm begging you. It was so obnoxious that I had to 
cancel my subscription. She wasn't. <laughs> okay, first of all, you don't have to cancel this. You just unsubscribe. Uh, and she left. I think there might be another comment in there that she left on my channel because she said something rude to me. And I told her she was being rude. I don't remember what it was. And I then she just that, automatically yeah. went to like hating me. Yeah. After watching I'm leaving. Videos. I'm unsubscribing. Yeah. It's like people, but this is not an airline. You don't have to announce your departure. How like if it's really that bad, you could just go. Is it that I got a hate comment on somebody, <laughs> somebody else's video? Honestly, that's like. She, in the whole like 20 minute long video, she said my name once. That's like a. That's once. Like a, for like three seconds, she mentioned me in passing, like under her breath. I, you and you, that you was, can say that you really made that it. That was the only thing that she know? commented on the whole video <laughs> the whole unboxing all those big beautiful rare plants and this woman was just like no I hate chocolate jungle <laughs> right uh, the next one Roxanne Lefebvre uh, I don't know how to pronounce that last name anytime I see it Le Le I don't know Crash, Crash, can you get off like, the table get... please he's trying to go somewhere okay um, <laughs> meow does this crash your pants? Yeah, what's up, crash your pants? If anybody okay. said anything negative about you in the comments, forget about it. Unless they're like, your cat's fat. You automatically. Know, like, yeah, obviously. Automatically blocked. All right, so Roxanne Lefebvre said, are you really asking fans for corms and cuttings? You. No. 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 <laughs> okay. That was, I had to go oh, back easy. and remember what the hell she was talking about. That was a plant shopping video where I had mentioned that, like sometimes I'll mention, oh, I don't, I don't want to like buy this plant. I'd rather like get a corm or a cutting from someone. And I think she thought I meant from like I was asking the people watching the video for you're cuttings, just, and I was like, begging people no, I was just making a statement. Right. Well, I mean, it was weird. Yeah. I don't know why we're she just, was so offended. We just want to be outraged. When in, my, so bad. when in my three years on YouTube have I ever come on here and asked for anything besides for you to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe and, and hit the like notification bell so you don't miss anything and, like, from me? Like all of yeah. that stuff. Right. Like, literally never. Some perky perks. Yeah, those are okay. optional. Like, you all can right. Do what you want. Next one. Anthony Rivera says, no. "Oh my, can you just open the damn box already?" Why do you keep showing the open box with this styrofoam? Shaking my head. I don't get you showing plans or how to open a box. By the way, Happy New Year to y'all. Okay, Anthony, if you're watching, you know I love you. <laughs> but I had to include this one because you're ridiculous. <laughs> ridiculous. I like it. I like it. Um, yeah, people want to see how it's packaged, which is what I said. Yeah. It's not that deep. No. You should do a video that's like a half hour long if you're just about to take the plan out, but not ever taking it yeah. out. Yeah, well, there's and another just be like, one. thanks, plant fam. People really don't like how long it takes me to unbox plants, apparently. Oh, really? That's a thing? Yeah. Yeah, but then, like, how exciting is it if you're just, your cat's, like, totally wigging out, by the way. <laughs> he's, like, he's freaking out. I don't know why. And then, like, how ridiculous would it be to just get the box open the box and look, here's a plant. That's not exciting. No. All right. Anyway, next one. True C said, looks horrible. What looks horrible? I don't know. The plant. Oh, all right. Next one. Jay Andrews said, Plant pots need drainage to help prevent root rot and provide aeration to the roots. Having a plant pot without drainage is one of the easiest ways to kill a plant. If you don't have your watering and timing of watering down to a science. I have something to say about this. That is very... Just let me. <laughs> that is very poor plant advice to give people who are just learning to care for plants and need all the help they can get. Sorry, but I just unsubscribed. I'm going to cry myself to Don't sleep need to announce the departure. And by the way, I know nothing about the science of watering plants. And I've kept a mandula alive for a very long time because it's in a pot that doesn't have drainage. And it's beautiful and amazing. I just cut it, actually. And I don't know what I'm doing. And this thing is, like, amazing. Ooh, I think I need to cut so this one, too. There's that. I freaking love this plant. Look at it. Look at how pretty it is. Yeah, it used to hang behind me, but I just cut it, you guys would have seen in a plant shore video. Okay. Yeah, I mean, look, just use the pot that you think is pretty. Okay, but have here's drainage, the thing. Like... The video that he left this comment on, or I'm assuming it's a he, I don't know. Um, how dare I misgender you? It could I'm be sorry. Julie Andrews. Um, it could no, be. No, maybe not. It could no, be. Not. Um... So it wasn't a, a video about plant advice for new plant parents. 
I was talking about like I think it was like misconceptions or like busting like myths that you can just never ever ever put a plant in a pot with no drainage and in that video I actually explicitly stated all of this that if you're a new plant parent I wouldn't recommend it but with the right plant in the right environment it's fine especially like cacti succulents stuff like that that don't really get watered that often if you just are careful about how much water you put in and then like dump out the excess water it's not that complicated yeah don't water so, it like you work at home depot just like which i said waterboarding all of your plants in the video yeah. that clearly they didn't listen to it happens next one That's fantastic. Oh my god, okay, this was really good. Alright, HPB commented on one of your videos and said, I am totally with you on succulent arrangements. I love them. That is not the comment in question. No. Somebody replied to them, named Slavic, and said, At Jacqueline's Jungle, I hate this channel. <laughs> That's hysterical. <laughs> Why? It's very random. Why I are don't you know. replying to somebody else's comment and saying that? Oh, uh, that's beautiful. You're allowed to hate it. You know, that's the kind of drive-by hate that you just laugh at. Like, that's fantastic. You can hate it. I am sorry for your life. <laughs> Thank you for the engagement you had to comment <laughs> on like that, that video. Uh, next one. Country Girl says, I'm so glad I don't buy plants much anymore. Now my savings account is growing instead of plants. Okay. And your reply, guess it's a good thing you don't run a plant business. <laughs> and somebody pointed out, that country girl's comment smells a little bit like envy. Sorry, country girl. Yeah, basically like, what weird... you're telling me is you think I buy too many plants. Yeah, don't be judgy like that. When this is literally my job. If I just stopped going plant shopping and unboxing videos with you guys, would you still watch? <laughs> like, what would the content be? It would be the same plant. You should I'm unbox showing you the them, same plant like, over and over again. You should unbox them in slow motion. People would, <laughs> People would really love that. People would love that. Uh, oh, here's the oh, here's the one. I was oh, waiting for this Mary. one because I knew this was happening. Mary, I need Mary, a sip of my seltzer. Mary <laughs> Roman, you need something stronger than seltzer for this one. Do you not like Jews or just wandering Jews? I was enjoying your video until I heard that. Choose your words wisely. So if you guys saw like, my little, I did a reel and like a short, right? Like had a bunch of these pop up on screen. And this was the one that people responded to the most. Like did, <laughs> did I really just say that? So here's the thing. I was in like Home Depot or like Lowe's or something. And I was looking at a Tritoscantia. And I was saying that I don't like the plant. That I think the plant is ugly. And then I put it back. And that was it. And then this lady commented, asking me... <laughs> you hate the Jews. Do you hate the Jews? Like, I don't even put the call the plant that. Back. I said, <laughs> I might have mentioned, like, that the common name uh, is Wandering Jew, but that, like, we don't call it that anymore because it's, like, we've all agreed that it's, like, kind of offensive. So, I'm just like, wait, did you just equate a whole entire group of people to <laughs> plants? Because I said I don't like... The plant? My goodness gracious. That is baffling. <laughs> Mind blown. Mary, I don't know what planet you're on, sweetheart, but I'm going to need you to come back to Earth reality. <laughs> I know you're not watching. <laughs> NMT, I deal with this problem by not ordering plants in the winter. You should read my reply. Your reply, I'm sorry you're so miserable that you felt this comment was necessary. You can get 10% off. Your first month of therapy at betterhelp.com slash Jacqueline's Jungle. So can you, actually. That's <laughs> <laughs> better H E L P no, dot com, and I'm not even getting paid for this video. That's fantastic. Not sponsored. Well, yes, but not this one. Yeah. Well, hey, man, don't. Really um, so that anything. one's fun because that was a package that I got over the winter where the plants were cold damaged. And the reason why the plant was cold damaged is because it took too long to get here. Um,. Yeah. So is that one of the ones they opened up and left open? I don't know. In, in it a was warehouse UPS, somewhere or something. UPS screwed me over oh, by UPS. taking too long to deliver it, and it sat on. Remember, it sat on the cold truck all day. Right. I just had a glimpse of the next one. 
This one's so, directed at me. That one really pissed me off, though, because it was so sarcastic and right. like, rude for right. no reason. Uh, okay, so this next one is directed at me. Is it? Um, I think so. Oh, yeah, 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 because this was a comment on the last video. This is so cool. This is like Inception. <laughs> so but like I did the comments. hate comment video, and then you said something. All right. In the last comment video at the 17 minute and 15 <laughs> second mark, uh, I made a hateful comment that an anglerfish looks like Nancy Pelosi. <laughs> the way they say it is, okay, the video is about hateful comments, and he used an anglerfish and Nancy Pelosi in the same sentence, as if he's saying Nancy Pelosi looks ugly or looks like an anglerfish. It's not as if I'm saying, I explicitly saying. stated that Nancy Pelosi She's looks like looking. a That's creature from the deep. what nightmares are made out of right there. Well, yeah, I mean, the lady's face what is kind of sliding off. What fun are political figures if you can't make fun of them? Right. Yeah, I mean, it's like she's like my sleep demon, you know, with a little, like, thing hanging. It's, like, shiny. And I'm like, what's that? And it's like, bah! Right? For the children. Yeah, for the children. Um, there you go. So, my reply to her was, you're right. I didn't mean to insult the angler fish. I apologize to all of the fishes. Fish are friends, not, not food. Not food. That's fantastic. Oh. She replied and said, Okay. I have no idea what this interaction actually means. She was, she thought she caught you. She thought she got, it was a gotcha that you yeah. were, we were talking about hate comments and that you made one. Right. No, she, she was right though. I, I did insult the angler fish. And yeah. It was very rude. That is rude. Right. Just Meg said, please don't tug on leaves and whack the plants. Please. So many of you YouTubers do this and it drives me nuts. You wouldn't want anybody tugging the plants at your shop. Don't come and tug um, my plants. So, next time I went plant shopping, I was literally going like this on the leaves. I was like slapping them in the... <laughs> you can see me in the next plant shopping <laughs> video after this one. I was slapping the leaves. I was like, do 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 do. Yo, mind your business. Fine. The plants are fine. Mind your business. The plants are fine. Seriously, leaf petter for life. I mean, does, does this person comment on the fact that these places literally drown their plants <laughs> yeah. daily. Yeah. Like, it's not that, you know. No. Yeah. That's fine. Right. But God forbid I touch the leaves. The plant really hates she that. She said, I try not to touch what I'm buy what I'm not buying, and you're not buying. You didn't buy one thing. Do you know how difficult it would be to talk <laughs> about a plant without touching it? You know, we just point at them all? I mean, you... You want to know. Plus, I'm like, I'm, I'm a sensory person. Yeah, you know? like, like, well, you're trying to see if things are turgid. Well, and you feel like the thickness of the leaf, the texture of the leaf. Like, I like to touch leaves. Leave a comment down below if you're also a leaf petter. <laughs> I'm totally a leaf petter. Yeah. All right, next one. Rob Anderson. Rob Rob needs the, the better help link. Yeah. Um, I can't imagine growing plants on a bookshelf, period with books period i mean that would and your reply was then don't i don't know why you can't imagine it it's very easy to picture it is pretty so, easy to picture yeah, plus books. like books make really great like decor with your plants like i like to even like we stack a couple of books right. and then put a plant on top of it it just for like styling purposes just helps fill in empty gaps. We're not like willy-nilly hosing the bookshelf down or anything no. like that. Like nothing's getting damaged. It's fine. No. You right. shouldn't be watering right. your plants in place if the water's not staying contained to the pot. Then you need to take it to the sink. So um, if you don't like growing mm. your plants on bookshelves with books, then you shouldn't do that. Yes. And I enjoy it, so I'm gonna do that. Right. Okay. <laughs> Don't put books... I can't imagine putting books on plant shelves with plants. Crazy. Anyway, next one. Oh, this one's good. I like it when people do this, where they say, her obsession with perfection is funny. If you're commenting on the video... I don't get it. You're saying her, like, it's... It's, it's like, like... You know I'm the only one who's reading it, right? <laughs> yeah, like, it's your channel. <laughs> yeah. So her obsession with perfe perfection is funny, and your reply, did your mom not hug you enough or something? <laughs> wow. Damn, girl. Why else would you, if you were not a miserable human being, why would you leave a comment like that? Right. 
Plus, mm. what are you even referring to? What obsession with perfection? I don't know. I literally, what have I ever said that makes know. you think that I'm obsessed with things being perfect? Once, anything, once in a while, you're about, like, oh, like oh, my hair's a mess today or something. But like, yeah, but that's, that's just not... because I feel like a mess. And I, if I say it, right. it takes away the power from somebody else saying it. Yeah. Do you understand what I mean? If I feel like I look like crap and I say I feel like I look like crap, then if somebody else comments and says I look like crap, I don't feel bad because I already said it. <laughs> Right. Do you know what I mean? It's not like I was trying yeah. to look good and I ended up looking like crap. I knew that I didn't do my hair and makeup that day. But you guys don't care. Yeah, I mean, if no, I you don't care. It's just me. Like right. it's. Do you know how hard it is to be on camera and looking at yourself when you feel like you don't look cute? Then you're going to be like, Ugh, I don't look cute. Yeah. If I start a video and I'm like, I look like a lump of duty today. <laughs> And then people that's are like, you song. look like a lump of duty today. I'd be like, let's yeah, all sing it together. that's great. But if like, they had good. just said that without you saying it, yeah. that would be hurtful. I mean, yeah, like granted, it's a rare occasion where I'm starting a video. I'm like, I look fly AF. <laughs> Some really good ones on here. Yeah. This next one from... Oh, the, this one's my favorite. You got to read the whole thing. Yeah, I'm going to read the whole thing. <laughs> Ahmad Asraf Hashim says, hair and sunglasses look like Jackie O, but that fur t-shirt got to go. Basically, my my black t-shirt was covered in cat hair. So was everything else in our apartment. That's fine. <laughs> Your reply, if you want to come be my lint rolling assistant, you're more than welcome to. While you're at it, you can also brush my cats multiple times a day, so don't shed as much. Maybe vacuum as well. <laughs> Their reply was, don't feed the troll. And uh, your reply was, I am the troll. <laughs> Checkmate. <laughs> Next one, something or other, Zagreb, uh, said, when you don't buy anything, this is not shopping. You guys know I already told you about this one. This is making video when you haven't idea. Yeah. And you said, no, it's still shopping. It's not shopping. <laughs> if you don't like it, don't watch. Pretty simple. Yeah. Oh, and then they commented again and said that they don't plan on watching again. It was their first and last video. Mm -hmm. So I said... I can just block you, and then you'll never see me again. That's nice. Yes. It was scorched earth. I like it. <laughs> but you guys already know, because I was so irritated by that comment that I said something in the video that I filmed, like, the day after, because I went shopping again, and I was, like, complaining <laughs> about it. Because uh, I'm like, yeah. really? If you go to the mall and you try on a bunch of clothes, but you don't like anything, so you don't buy anything, do you tell people that you went shopping still? Or do you say that I went and I didn't buy anything? No, wow. you say I went shopping. Well, that was deep. You still, you're still shopping. You're shopping around. You're window shopping. Right. There's a difference Correct. between shopping and buying. They're two separate words for a reason. If they were the same thing, then we wouldn't have two words. Yeah. You shop around. Like you do, like when you buy yes, a car, you shop around. You don't buy a car at every dealership you go to. No, oh, you go car shopping. You shop. Right. Girl, and if I bought a plant every time I went plant shopping, where in the hell would I put them all? Mm -hmm. I go plant shopping like three times a week. Yeah, you do. Where would I put, and I would have like 20 of the same plant because I see the same plants over and over and over and over again, and I have them already. Everything that I would want. You have to rename these videos. You're going to be like, plant tour at Home Depot. <laughs> I do, though. No, I'll do plant shopping plus, like, greenhouse tour. But I stopped putting tour, right? that in the title because it takes up so much space. For sure. But I used to do that. Uh, next one. Well, damn, now those Lowe's employees are going to be busy picking up the dead leaves that you threw on the floor. They should. And you said that's their job. <laughs> so, yeah. Also, like... Is it your fault the dead leaves were there? I was pruning the plant. Uh, yeah, because I was pruning the plant because that you they haven't water watered <laughs> yes. in two weeks. They either don't or they water. Because I am hoping that if I prune the plant and it doesn't look like it's dying, that somebody will actually buy it. So right. yeah, you should pick up the dead leaves off the floor. That's literally what you're getting paid for. Next one, Linda Cunningham said, "I don't like your snake." Well, piss off, Linda. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody asked you, Linda. Screw <laughs> off, Linda. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I think that's the last one. Hope that was snake. recent. Hope I was hanging out with... Find a snake in your toilet. I was hanging out with Eden while I was talking about um, plants that aren't worth the hype. And a couple of people got cranky about it. That I should have been holding plants and not a snake. 
Um, like last time I checked, this is my channel, and I have pet snakes. Right. And I'm. I gave you fair warning. I didn't put her on screen. I gave you warning. I have a snake. I am going to hold said snake up <laughs> in the frame in a few minutes. If you do not like snakes, you should click off this video. This video is not for you if you are afraid of snakes or don't like snakes and don't want to look at a snake. But realistically, she sat in my hand like this the whole time. And right. I put pictures of plants over that, her. Honestly, that's way more than I would do. I'd be like, I'd I just start the video and I've got this snake on me and I'm like, well, we're doing well, a video. With I'm a trying to be today. respectful because I know a handful of people personally that Freak watch out. my videos that get scared when they see snakes. So I'm trying to give them fair okay. warning sure. that there's, good, but like she's in the thumbnail too. And it says in the thumbnail, like featuring Eden. So like, <laughs> you can't, it's, it's just, this is what happens. This is why I'm just like, people don't listen and they have really bad reading comprehension. Well, this was a nice round of hate comments. <laughs> it was, mm -hmm. right? I feel like they weren't as hateful no, as no. the first round. For sure. Um, I think they're more entertaining than anything. Yeah. Um, I don't get a lot of negative comments. And you know what? I get more love and positivity from you guys than anything else. You are the best the sweetest human beings you literally make me smile every single day you have no idea how much i love and appreciate you guys like it's Plant not fan for life. it's really not i can't i couldn't possibly put it like into words that would ever feel adequate enough to right. explain my gratitude and um how much i love you guys <laughs> You're so cute. Wait, the kids do hearts different these days with their hands. How do you do them different? I don't know. We always went like this, but they do this other... It's going to look like gang signs. They do this other thing. I can do those too. <laughs> I can't, really? But I can't do a heart. Wait, no, they go like... Uh, I'll figure it out off screen. Because <laughs> I'm going to feel stupid. <laughs> anyway, okay. Let's end the video before yes. I get distracted and start rambling. I love you guys. Um, if you enjoyed hanging out with us today, you should definitely give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything from me. There's a join button down there if you want to be part of the official plant fam. Get yourself some perky parks. If not, there's a super thanks button if you want to super thanks me. Everything is appreciated. You know I can't do this without you. I love you so, so very much. Definitely go and give him a subscribe we have our own channel too david and jacks where we do stuff sometimes and we put it on there but also members are going to start getting like some more vlogs from us too so yeah. definitely check out the membership program and i love you uh leave me what kind of emojis should they leave me if they watched the whole entire video just pick one the first one that pops into your head uh, uh, petting a leaf it's not an emoji. <laughs> no, it's not. A leaf in a hand? Petting oh, it? Okay. You're not a leaf. But no, but you do pet me. I do. Like so, my... there's that. You fuzzy. Eh, I know, I like this shirt. Yeah. I don't know what this band, but I like this that shirt. That furry shirt's gotta go. So. <laughs> this one's not covered in cavity yet. Because it's new. Anyway, I love you guys so, so very much, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Are you farting? <laughs> no, it's the, it's the seed. Oh, it's the seed. <laughs> the seed. Sure it is. It never makes that it's sound like when my butt's on it. Fall weather. <laughs> you can't. I can't do it again. <laughs> I'll try it. That's so messed up. That's so messed up. What, this one's what fantastic. Do you, like, what do you want book. from me? <laughs> no, that was good. You don't even know. I'm gonna start, you're gonna look at the camera. This <laughs> is, you make it so difficult. I know, really, that's terrible. Okay, ready? No. <laughs>